And then there were eight. Spain, Brazil, Germany, Belgium, it's the England and the United States and Slovenia. It's the quarterfinal stages of the 2002 World Cup. Five players remaining in the chase for the golden boots. Rivaldo and McElroy lead it. Brian McBride and Paul Scholes and Francesco Totti on four goals apiece. Quarterfinal number one emanates from the Sizzle World Cup Stadium. Brazil are in it. They beat England in the real fix-up with a famous accidentally on purpose goal from Ronaldinho that ended David Seaman's international career. Spain have already knocked out the current world champions. France the winners of 1998. Brazil with the runners-up. Can Spain do the double? It's a talented Spain side that would love to shake that stigma of being underachievers and to being favourite. Brazil are the better of these two sides but he narrowly escaped Niigata by eliminating Portugal. And we're on the way to our final number one in Shizuoka. Here comes Joaquin arrowing down that right hand flank. He's ahead of Gilberto Silva and Roberto Carlos. Back to Carlos Puyo. Cuts inside. Gilberto. Oh, what a strike. Ran in the crossbar. Marcos has been shook. Raul's cross is deflected by Luciao. Stubbornly trying to find a way through. And it's intercepted by Rocco Jr. Ruben Baraka scored against France. Oh, and Morientes on the crafty one. Raul. Morientes pulls the trigger. It's a comfortable save for Marcos. Here is Rivaldo, one of the leading goal scorers in the competition. Has found Ronaldinho. Gilberto Silva lets Morientes escape him. Oh, and Marcos flaps at it. Rivaldo receives it down the line from Cafu. Rivaldo, one and one. Oh, and it's a valuable block from Nadal. Ronaldo on the volley, just over. Brazil have awakening from their slumber. When they come forward, it's frightening. Rivaldo back to Clemson. Seeks out Ronaldinho on the left foot and is plucked out of the air by Casillas. Baraka to Joaquin. The corner kick punch clear by Casillas. It's Ronaldinho back into the mixer for Rivaldo on the volley. Where's the centre half? Yero in a very inappropriate position. Oh, Ramon has hesitated. It's gone in, but it doesn't count. Free kick to Brazil. Cleberson threading it through to Rivaldo. One on one, but Casillas. And St. Ica stands his ground. It is stops time in the first half. A defiant last charge from Spain. Oh, and Morientes has pulled it wide. That brings an end to a thrilling first half here in Shizuoka. Clebson under pressure has gave it away to Valeron. It's still Valeron has a strike and Marcos spills it. And Morientes is there to clean up the residue. Three minutes into the second half in Spain, have the lead over Brazil. The France 98 runners up are behind in the World Cup quarter final to the underachievers. Marcos couldn't deflect Valeron strike correctly. Spain are coming back for seconds. Joaquin down the middle to Fernando Morientes. Ruben Baraka has found the top corner. The underachievers are now the believers. It's Ruben Baraka. Spain have one foot in the semi final. Two goals in seven minutes, and Brazil are imploding. It was an even first half, and this second half has been dominated by La Rouge. Here comes Baraka, Spain. Are on fire. Valeron, oh, on the volley. Ronaldo has found a way through, but Poyo covers confidently. Oh, not so confidently, perhaps. Ronaldo has dispossessed him. Back to Ronaldinho. Oh, it's another comfortable save for Casillas. Catches the bullet. Rivaldo looking at options. Threads it through to Cafu. Enrique. A lazy leg stretched out. Ronaldinho straight underneath Casillas' body. Brazil will have a lifeline. It's game on here in Shizuoka. 
And it's the first goal of the 2002 World Cup for Ronaldinho. It's not the first time Brazil have found themselves behind in this competition, not the first time they found themselves two goals down. Ronaldo helping it on to Rivaldo, tipped away by Casillas. It's a sprint between Enrique and Cafu. Enrique cuts inside, plays it into Raul. Can't hit the target. Brazil fighting to remain in the game. Ronaldinho with the corner in. And Roberto Carlos scuffs it from close range. Rivaldo, options to the left in Carlos. Gilberto helps it on. Receives it once again. Rivaldo is there. Back to square one. And it's goal number six for Rivaldo. What a tournament he's had. Can't stop scoring. Can't stop dragging his squad against their will. Further and further into this competition. But for now he's locked the scores. Extra time looms. A fire has been lit underneath Brazil. Silver on the volley. It floated. Deep in stoppage time. Rivaldo with the ball in. Ronaldo is unmarked. Oh! Of all the places. This match must continue. What a start to the quarter-final round of the World Cup. Roberto Carlos, those massive legs powering in a way past Ruben Maraca, forces a spill from Casillas. The substitute Danielson has turned the game around finally in Brazil's favour. Super sub, six minutes into extra time, only 24 to go. Carlos with a bullet across the face of Carlos Casillas just couldn't hold it. As much as he wanted to from his teammate. As Danielson with a tap in. Fernando Morientes is unmarked. And Raul, oh, what a ball! It's a Real Madrid affair. Raul has equalised himself. And Morientes has been a fantastic tandem since the knockout stages. It's a dogfight in Shizuoka. Neither team is backing down. But the marking has just gotten progressively poorer at both ends. Here's Valeron, and loses the trigger. Fantastic save from Marcos, that was destined for the roof of the net. Preservation is key, one of these two teams will compete in the semi-final yet. Danielson, the freshest legs on the field perhaps. Cuts inside Nadal, and it's a scrappy strike. You would have expected better from one of the fitter players. Carlos, sprinting past Spain's defence, causing them all kinds of bother, but it's a wasteful attempt. And for the second time in this competition, the unfair penalty shoots out. Prince Raul to take the first penalty kick. Raul versus Marcos, and his first blood, hell of a penalty from Raul. The best player in the world, Ronaldo, converts just as you would expect. Fernando Morientes, the first goal scorer of this game, finds the back of the net once again. Super sub to Nielsen has been denied by the keeper. Spain have the advantage and Enrique can plunge them further into the depths of the competition. If he could score against Marcos, it's down the middle. Spain are in front. Ronaldinho versus Ica. Down the middle from Ronaldinho. Keeps Brazil alive. De Pedro versus Marcos. Hits the crossbar. Brazil can equalise through Roberto Carlos. Bang! Bottom corner. Scores a level again. Valeron versus Marcos and he skied it over. Brazil can go through if Cafu places this and finds the white net. Ah, no! Sudden death. Ruben Baraka versus Marcos. Baraka finds the top corner. It's all on Gilberto Silva now. And he chucks it confidently and calmly. Torres versus Marcos. Marcos saves. Kuru Torres must feel horrid. Cleverson to be the hero. Down the middle. And Brazil are through to the semi-finals. After a fight back from the dead. What a game in Shizuoka.
a remarkable game in Shizuoka. Cup. Three goals apiece and a 5-4 victory on penalties for Brazil. you got to feel bad for Spain. It was a remarkable effort and they certainly earned some newfound respect for their performances against France and Brazil. Rivaldo has claimed the top goal scorer spot of the competition as expected and quarter final two will be on its way shortly between Germany and Belgium. Let me know your predictions. Who is going to face Brazil in the semi-final in Seoul? Thank you everybody for your support so far. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in a bit.